Maybe she's out looking for clues. Explorer Edwin, Dr. Proctor, and Professor Beatrice reporting for scavenger hunting, Mama. Maybe she's Sarah's statue. From the book? As a doctor, I think that she is a statue. And as a professor, I see that she's pointing to something. Congratulations, you found your first clue. See if you can figure it out. Hmm, to find the golden wristband, the twisty maze should start your plan. Oh, oh, it's like the twisty maze made out of corn from Story Island. Hmm. But where can we find it? Maybe this sticker will show us. Look at the picture. This looks like your grandma and grandpa's house. Yeah, you're right, Professor Beatrice. Let's go. Hi, Grim. Hi, Grandpa. We're Billy and Millie Scarecrow. From Story Island. Billy and Millie. Then that must be the Twisty Maze. Oh. Hmm. Which way should we go? That way. <laughs> <laughs> Think about the book. Wait. In the book, it said to find the clues. Line up the shoes! That's it, Professor. We start here. Look, another clue. Good eyes, Professor. And thank you, Millie and Billy Scarecrow. This is the most fun I've ever had from a book. Where do we go next? Bird Hill. Where is that, Explorer Edwin? Bird Hill was on the side of Story Island with all the trees and grass. Oh, right. Well, that sounds like the park. See any unusual birds, Professor Beatrice? Nah, maybe one weird blue jay I've never seen before. Have a look, Explorer Edwin. I see something near that tree. Mama? Hi, kids. I mean. Ah uh ah! -huh, ah uh ah! -huh. Are you Florence Feathers, the magical bird? That's right, I am. You'll find your next clue in the air. Watch the feathers, please, with care. Hmm. Watch the feathers. Huh? Here's the clue. And the sticker. Hmm. My professor brain tells me this looks like an X. This map smells really sweet. You're right, Doctor. Like... Perfume. Just like in Story Island. Remember the clue hidden in the flower field? How will we find an X? It could be anywhere. Maybe we're too far away. Or maybe too close? That's it! Back up, everyone! <gasps> I see it, Dr. Popter and Explorer Edwin. I get it. Purple is Explorer Edwin's favorite color. But where's the clue? Maybe the clue is in the X. Life jackets? Where can you use life jackets? As a doctor, I think it's the pond. Hey, this is just like Turnabout Lake from Story Island. Let's explore. Hello, seafaring mates. I'm Fisherman Frank. Come on in, let's go fishing. <laughs> Hi, Hi, Fisherman Frank. Do we need bait? Not for this hook. Holler if you think you caught something. Love you. I 
love you too, sweetie. Have fun. Hi, boys. So glad you could join us for a sleepover. And on Gilroy's chore day, too. Dad. I'll help. I always do at home. Me, too. It feels quite nice, I think. Just wash your face with the water so you get used to it. Hold your breath. Dip your face in and come right up. <gasps> Hey! I did it! Want to learn some other stuff? Okay, try this. Kick your legs and then paddle your hands underwater. They call this dog paddling. I call it new paddling! Or goat paddling! I prefer sheep paddling. Grandpa, we're lava paddling. <laughs> and he's duck paddling. <laughs> hoof up, hoof down. Hoof up, hoof down. Hoof up. Hoof down, hoof up, hoof down. I think I'm hoof down when I'm supposed to be hoof up. <coughs> it happens, Dad. And when we're at the beach swimming in the ocean, there may be some waves splashing up. Just stay calm and don't panic. Remember, staying calm is always the best way to be safe. Now you put the strokes and the kicks together. tomorrow. My, there are hardly any waves. But still enough to splash around in. Let's go for it. Wait, maybe we could just play in the sand for a while. You know, get used to the place first. Uh-huh. Okay, but just for a little while. I'm in a splashy mood. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's time to get wet. Uh-huh. I think I'm ready. Now, don't worry, Llama Llama. Yes, simply recall all the lessons you learned in the pool. Or just do this. Yeah! Okay. Here goes. How does that feel? Well, it feels cold and wet. And I like the sand in my toes, and... Hey! I did it! I'm in the water! Now all I have to do is wash my face. And... Where's Grandpa? Oh no! Grandpa! I gotta help him! There's a lot more water than there was in that pool. I'll be right by your side, swim buddy. Okay. 
Let's do this thing. That's it, Grandpa. You're doing it. Next hoof. Next. Hey, this is pretty nice. In fact, it's really nice. Yeah! <laughs> I guess we don't have to wash our faces. Way to go, Llama Llama! Everybody ready? Affirmative. Good, because here it comes. Whoa! <laughs> definitely turned out to be a perfect beach day. Except for one problem. We don't ever want to go home! 